With the release of Season 14, we finally have access to the grapple gun. And I have to say, I'm disappointed. This is worthless. I will get to some positives about the grapple and how we completed the commendations for it, but first, I need to get something off my chest. Remember how awesome and possibly game-breaking the grapple gun looked when it was first showcased six months ago? What happened? I remember being worried that it might give too much of an advantage to boarders, but then I realized that I could use that advantage too, so it might be kind of fun. And they said it would be useful for grabbing loot. But look at the difference in range. And they said we could grapple to the tops of islands. But the difference is pretty obvious. I feel like I've been fed a pack of lies. The effort to keep this from being overpowered has made it unintuitive for what it can actually attach to. And it is incredibly rage-inducing to try to board a ship from the water with the water bug that has been haunting us on the seas for the past few seasons. Also, I have a question. Why is this atrocity in the weapon's armory? The grapple doesn't even cause damage to other players. Of course that's the way it works because we can't even get merchant supply quests anymore. But they can take the pellet out of the blunderbuss and what kind of magic ritual do I need to do to spawn the shrouded ghost? How the hell is any of this fair? Okay, I'm calm. I'm calm. The grapple gun at least causes damage to emergent PvE enemies, but I can't believe I'm about to say this. I'd rather use the double-barreled pistol because that can at least get the job done with one shot. I honestly didn't think there would be something in this game that I would dislike more than the double-barreled pistol, but here we are. It's so dumb. Oh, it's so dumb, it's brilliant. No! It's just dumb! If Rare is pushing forward with calling this a transversal tool, then it belongs in the equipment chest and in our radial wheels, or it can be an item that we find in the open world like tridents, but it does not belong in the armory. To be fair, I don't think I'd be as disappointed if the previews didn't set the expectations so high. So let's see what we can salvage here. And let's be calm. We're all calm here. Thankfully, there are only four things we have to do for commendations with this tool. Boarding a skeleton ship with a grapple is probably going to be the easiest commendation to knock out. Whereas press gang grappler and return to sender are going to rely a little bit more on finding or creating an opportunity. It's a tool, not a weapon. No reason to be scared. Yeah, don't shoot at us. We just want to grapple. It's not even a gun. Oh, that's a keg. Since the sloop clearly didn't want to play with us, we had to take our chances with the parked galleon. Luckily, they were on the same hunt for the new commendations and were more than willing to help. For anyone worried about this being too helpful for boarders, rest assured, <laughs> it's not. We basically had to be on top of each other just to trade ships. And it's like by that point, you might as well just jump off and just climb on as normal. Despite all of the bugginess from this update and my disappointment with the grapple, this season has been amazing for unintentionally bringing crews together for new experiences. Ooh, the grapple gun was actually useful. Which felt like some of the old adventures where we had to cooperate with other crews to complete a common goal. We have Lord of Chaos right here. Do you get something for a barrel walking on your own ship? I just love the, the visual of two barrels walking on the <laughs> <laughs> for no other reason. <laughs> not you have two barrels. On my game, uh, Lord of Chaos is just is just boots. Yeah. He's just boots. <laughs> I have unlocked the biggest the biggest sneak right here. <laughs> and it turned out that we shared some common thoughts about the grapple. It feels weird that certain parts of the ship you just cannot attach to. Like I should be able to get on the, my own mast. I should be able to like. Spider-Man my way up there. And I get it, they, they made it so that it's not so easy to board and, and I, I appreciate that. Oh, it's so dumb, it's brilliant. No! It's just dumb! I wish like when you actually like successfully like move, you could keep your, the, the arrow. Oh, you wouldn't waste yeah. a slot. Yeah, oh, I, yeah. I thought the yeah. same thing. And then I was like, am I asking for too much with that though? That's yeah. why we're gonna go to Shipwreck Bay because there's like ammo boxes all over the island. 
So I'm just gonna Spider-Man all over that place. Which brings us to the Isle Hopper commendation where you have to grapple 10,000. 10,000 what, you may ask? From what we could tell, it seems to be close to paces. But the grapple distance traveled doesn't really match up to paces enough for me to say that confidently. And although the grapple will never feel like this, it's still kind of useful for getting to skeleton thrones and zooming through the water. And it reduces fall damage from high places. Once you get an idea for the length of the grapple line, it can be fun to Spider-Man swing around places like Shipwreck Bay. You just have to make it a priority to know where to find the ammo chests on the islands. And I highly suggest packing plenty of food in your pockets because this thing is more of a danger to yourself than anybody else. I also know that 10,000 sounds like a lot, but it only took us about an hour to complete this at Shipwreck Bay with this route. While I was making this video, Beard Berserk posted that he has already earned the cherished trinket for grappling 45,000 distances, which is absolutely insane. No matter how far you want to go with the grapple, keep in mind there are plenty of ways to get this done. This just happens to be the way we did it to hit 10k. If you want to see how Beard Berserk hit 45,000, there's a link to his channel in the description. Anyway, I know I've spent a lot of time complaining about the grapple, but after playing with it over the past few days, I can see the potential, and I have even caught myself having a little bit of fun with it. Oh, yes! Oh, What's oh. Up? Thank you guys for your help. One, one of the few times I actually had a lot of fun in this game <laughs> with other people that I don't know. Well, usually they try to kill me. You've killed me before. Who has? Yes, you. She has. Me? Yes. I did? Was I nice? Yes. yes. Was I nice in your death? Did you suffer? I am no, so not really. sorry. You stole my emissary flag. It's Shame. fine. It's Poor CFDs. Shame. I don't even care. No, this is Lady Hysteria. I was like, oh no, we're, we're done. I was like, you're gonna kill us. <laughs> you have a reputation. I, to out. You had a I like that uh, you waited until now to tell me. I know. Well, he was he was afraid if, if he told you sooner your blood was <laughs> Merge right. and just kill everyone. No, I'm a nice person. 